Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. We are in Season 2, playing Chrono Trigger, Episode 5. We've just been bumped through the portal to somewhere through the psychedelics. Oh, no, it's not that kind of game. Uh, so, we just got uh, bumped through the portal into the middle of the forest. And if I were king of the forest, I would have beat up those blue imps that we had. And since uh, I did, I guess that makes me king of the forest, right? All right, so we got a guy over there and a chest. I would really, really like that chest. If you're very careful, you can technically avoid the battles, but I want the XP and the money, so I'm going to go ahead and beat these guys up and take their lunch money. Bam! Good thing they're a little soft. Four XP. Two tech points, 24 gold. Yes, please. All right, let's come down this way. And we got a power glove. Um, potion, shelter, weapons, helms. Oh, power glove, what does that do? Oh, strength plus two, that is an accessory. Okay. So let's bump up and let's go to equipment. All right, so the headband increases my speed. The power glove is going to bump up my strength. Hmm. Now. Hmm. So, if I bring my strength up to 9, my attack will go from a 13 to a 15, and my speed's only going to drop by 1. Now, the speed does help you with your ability to queue up the next action, so having a higher speed will help you do the next attack. More attacks per round means you kill them faster, although if you hit them harder, they die quicker and you don't need as many rounds to make it stick. Uh, let's go ahead and let, let's try the, let's do the power glove for now. See how that goes. If it doesn't work, it's not like we can't change it back. All right, so we got our little power glove. Let's, uh, get the little roly-poly here. All right, let's do our tech, let's do our cyclone. And let's hit all three of them in one shot. Yes, please. Y'all can be dying now. Bam, bam, bam. Yeah! 7 XP, 3 tech points, 49 gold, and a potion. A pear tree. Um, oh man. Uh, I should probably be consulting one of my maps. No, I don't need to. Alright, there's also a potion hiding up here. And no, this is not the place that... Uh, I know there are some shrubs that you got to go shake to get a couple extra things. Alright, so. This is the canyon past the fair, and we are in the year... I don't know. We're missing a few buildings over here. The town looks alright. So, uh... Let's start asking people what's up. A millennial fair? Here? Have you been in your cups? That's different phrasing. Okay. Our kingdom is only 600 years old. King Guardia the 21st. Interesting, they missed the Roman numerals there. <laughs> King Guardia the 21st still reigns, last I checked. Hmm. I scarce remember the days before the war against the Fiend Lord began. Yeah, I definitely gotta double check that. I, I think that's another verbiage change there. The months turn to years. When will this all end? Woe is me. Alright, so that was that residence. There's the market over here, right? And that, yep, yeah, okay. Just double checking. What we got at the market? So you have a mind to buy some weapons and join the fight against the Fiend Lord's army, have you? Wonderful. But remember to equip the weapons you buy. Not much meaning elsewise. Yeah, that is slightly important. <laughs> you didn't come all this way just to look, did you? Surely there's something you'd like to buy. Oh, there's that... I think I've already got the... Yeah, I've already got the bronze blade. 
Uh, nobody that can use the pea shooter yet. I've already got the padded vest and a bronze helm. I'm not going to worry too much about the other stuff at the moment. I haven't been using them yet. I'm going to keep the headband. My thanks do come again, at least for now. There will be a way to get those chests that were back there later. We'll get to that in a minute. Well, not in a minute, but you know what I mean. All right, let's go yak to everybody in the bar. I mean, sorry, at the inn. The Fiend Lord's army laid waste to Zenon Bridge. We've lost our only road to the southern continent. Oh, praise be, they found Queen Linny wandering up in the canyon. She'd been missing for so long, I'd feared the worst. Um, the canyon that I just came out of? Must be back at the castle by now, getting some much-needed rest. I think our hearts are a little more at ease now. When Clean Lenny disappeared, it was all the king could think of. He thought the Fiend Lord's doing and dispatched soldiers to the four corners of the realm to find her. But she's been found, and that's all that matters. Hmm. You an outsider, too? The name's Toma. I'm an explorer, and you can... Sp and if you can spare 10 gold to buy this round, I'll be a storyteller too. What do you say? Let's buy the man a drink. Another mug. Here's friend. Well then, a promise is a promise. It's about the missing queen. My travels have taken me to the cathedral in the western wood, and there's something most peculiar about that place. It's only a hunch, but... Beg your pardon? They found Queen Linny in the canyon? Hmm, it seems my suspicions were misplaced. Something tells me we're going to be adventuring out to the western wood. Barkeep. Hey, don't, don't ignore me. I'm trying to spend money here. Hey. Fine. I won't talk to you then. Bear, have you gone mad? There's no time for mirth and mummery. Mummery? Okay. <laughs> Where are you, you say? You some sort of simpleton? Even a halfwit should know this is the land for Guardia. Our kingdom wages war with the Fiend Lord's army day and night, fighting to restore the realm's peace. Pray tell you knew that much, at least. Uh, of course. Then might you show the good grace to stop wandering about pestering folk with moronic questions? You're lucky I can't fight you. Rooms are 10 gold for the night. Um, not at the moment. Let's take a quick check on our inventory. 76 out of 96 hit points. That, that's not low, but that's not as high as I'd like either. But uh, you know what? We'll, we'll save the gold. We'll spare the gold. Oh, look at this. Here's that box that we tried to open earlier. Again, remember, this is one of those boxes that uh, if you go... We can't open them yet, but we know that this one exists in 600. So we know later on, if we try to open it in 600, say no, and then go later. And I think 1000 is the um, latest that this inn is available. What we'll find out before too long, you'll get the upgraded version instead of the simple version. All right, welcome. Anything in the uh, chest? I mean, no. Okay. Let me down the stairs. So that's what's up at the end. There is no ferry. Hmm. What about this residence? I'm bent of the village blacksmith. I'm forging this bell at the king's behest as a symbol of his love for Queen Lenny. Hmm. Lenny's bell, huh? The queen's vanishing act had me wondering if all this work would be for naught. After all, what's the bell without a queen, huh? But it seems they found her in the canyon up north. She's back at the castle now, and I'm back to work. My husband wants a daughter, both clever and fair. Hmm. Alright. So... Somebody standing guard at the bridge? Yeah. <laughs> the Fiend Lord's army laid waste to this bridge. We're working to repair it, but until Sir Cyrus returns, 
We must see the kingdom's defense as well. Oh, look at that 8 bit sunset. Or is it a sunrise? Nah. Alright, we're not going to go to the cathedral yet because all clues point to the castle. So let's fight our way through the forest. I probably should have picked up a couple of things in the forest ahead of time, but oh well. Alright, tech. Cyclone. Let's get everybody in one shot, please. Thank you. Bam! Now, will you guys have the good grace to die quickly? Good. 10 XP. 3 tech points. And 74 bucks. And a potion. Nice. Obtained a strength capsule. <laughs> that used to be a power tab. Alright, so... Let me go ahead and permanently raise my strength by one. Bam! Alright, I've got four potions. Uh, 70, 80, 90. It's only down by 20, so that... Yeah, no. It's not worth using the potion just yet. It feels a little too much like a waste of a potion. Oh, what's this down here? A battle? Give me that beautiful XP. Bam! Eat it! Ten XP, four tech points, eighty gold. Oh, you know, I. How much till my next uh, tech anyway? Uh oh, I need seventy-three tech points. That might be a little bit. All right, let's find our way through the forest. No, I cannot roll my R's like in uh, the Wizard of Oz. Let's at least knock you guys out in one shot, although I'm burning through my very limited magic points. I may have to run by the inn and spend a night. Although fortunately these guys give me enough money that that's not that big a deal. Bam! 9 XP, 75 gold, and a potion. And a pear tree. Alright, just double checking to make sure... Yep, okay, good. That's where all those points were. And we've got our suspicious shrubs. What's in here? A shelter. Ooh, nice. And where was our other suspicious shrub? Come on, I know there was one more. All right, fine. And, oh, there's another one of our mysterious boxen. Good to remember that it's in the forest. And let's head up to the castle. Alright, we're about 20 minutes in. A little less than 20 minutes, right? Yeah, because we started at 150. Alright, um... I'm debating on how... Nah, I'm not going to cut it that short. That's a little too short for an episode. Halt! Who goes there? I have not seen your face before, and those outlandish clothes wouldn't be one of the Fiend Lord agents, would we? Ah, fat chance. Look at him. That boy's not built to lift his sword, let alone serve in the Fiend Lord's army. Suppose you're right. Now run along, boy, before we're forced to lock you up in the towers. Stop that at once. Queen Lenny. Huh, she looks familiar, doesn't she? That man is my friend, and you will treat him as such. But your majesty, there's something strange about his look. Alright, even an 8-bit. You can tell that she's given them the look. You refuse to obey my orders? No, I... Forgive me, my lady. Please, enter. I didn't know the queen would giggle. 
<laughs> Please pardon us. We'd no idea you were Her Majesty's guest. That's right. I envy you to be favored by the Queen. Oh, am I favored by the Queen or, you know, favored by the Queen? The Master of Kitchens has a foul temper. Best stay out of his way unless you fancy a tongue lashing. The dining hall is below. Alright, um, yeah. Let's come down here. Let's play in the kitchen. I'm dying. I'm dying of hunger. Seriously, dude. Your meal is ready. <laughs> Finally. Are you kidding me? I'm dying of hunger. No, no, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> the dining hall is for members of the knighthood, but you're welcome at our tables. Eat your fill before you go. Hunger, my lord, take a seat at the upper left corner of the table. The fiend lord troops had better watch out for us. The master of kitchens has earned his post. His cooking is worthy of at least three stars. <laughs> three stars out of how many, good sir? Three stars out of how many? All right. Um, what will you have? have? Seem to have lost my place in the guide. So let's go ahead and get a spice roast. Just a moment, then. Um. Sound like explosions? All right. Here we go. Nom nom nom. Hit point and magic point restored. Good, that saved us ten bucks at the end. Alright, what can we do for the Master of Kitchens? So you and Her Majesty the Queen are... acquainted? No. No, no, no. Not like that. The kitchen is a battlefield in its own right. Mm-hmm. Have you come to season my broth with your lack of culinary experience? Out! You've no place in my kitchen. I've known some chefs like that. <clears throat> oh, what in the name of all this goodness? Eyes cream that Her Majesty so wishes I prepare. Yeah, Arcadius, you, you wouldn't know which cook I'm talking about, would you? Alright, what else you got? I don't know, he's gonna fuss at me about the lack of culinary yada yada. Okay, those were not boxes. That's a box. With an ether. <laughs> it's one of the places where they left the old uh, the old name in there. Oops. Well, hello. And a hello to your troops, too. Commander, where is our food and drink? Oh, Commander, beg pardons. Not quite ready. Mm-hmm. My men and I risk our lives in this war. Is it so much to ask that you keep us fed? Quickly now. Master of Kitchens, enough of your self-righteous ranting. You knights aren't the only ones putting your lives on the line for this kingdom. Hmm. I think I've lost my appetite. I have no stomach to sit in the table for the player character to use. I, I mean, I have no stomach for meat and braised, meat braised and cowardice. See that my men are fed. Go find somewhere else to command. I don't need you telling me how to do my job. The two of them are brothers, but they've never gotten on well together. Hmm. Our new commander is working hard to fill Sir Cyrus's shoes. Uh. Didn't know they needed filling. Our commander is a good man. The master of kitchens, but rubs him the wrong way. You don't say. Okay, he's going to remind me to go eat. All right, he's still going to be overconfident. Three stars still. Nom nom nom. Alright. <laughs> the master's stubborn and strict, but he's a good man. Charlie Brown. My husband chose this life because he is a pacifist. 
arrogant jackanapes thinks the only people making sacrifices are the ones with swords. Yeah, okay. Same message. Alright, uh, so before we go on to the next bit of castle, we're actually going to go ahead and I'm going to insert a cut here. So those of you watching live, we've got one more go round. Those of you watching on YouTube, you'll see that next go round tomorrow. <laughs> That's right, I live stream this Thursdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. And it's a live recording of the next six episodes. So if you would like to know the future, join on Mixer or Twitch, your choice. I simulcast to both of them, 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern on Thursdays. And uh, make sure that you follow, subscribe, all you know, the proper nomenclature for the site you're using to get notified when I go live. If you missed a bit or you want to get caught up on the series... I post all the episodes up to YouTube. A new clip goes up each day, six days between the streams. And if you're on the live stream, YouTube channel is down in the description below. If you're on YouTube, congratulations. You're already where the next episode is going to be. Make sure you subscribe so you get notified when it goes live. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget that if you have any quips, quotes, queries, complaints, quandaries, or other whatnot, to leave them in the comments below. So those of you watching live, hang tight with me. I'm going to insert the cut, and then we'll do one last episode. Those of you on YouTube, I'll see you tomorrow.